Body weight lunges. All right. So when I'm lunging, what I'm doing, I just want to show you the motion. I'm working the quads, the glutes, and the hamstrings. I'm stepping out, and then I'm not coming forward. That's not a lunge. I want to keep my back straight, and I want to drive this knee down to the ground, okay? Down and up. So you'll notice, actually, my body stays straight, and it doesn't move forward, it doesn't move backwards, it just goes up and down when I find the point at which to actually lunge down, okay? Before I lunge, I want to remember a couple of things. Three things, actually, to keep my spine straight, first of all. So I'm not leaning my head forward or tilting it back too much. I'm squeezing my shoulder blades together to expand my chest a bit. Not a lot, just a bit, so that I have a nice straight back. And I'm tightening my core. And then I'm breathing into that, okay? As I step forward, at no time do I want to come off the heel of my front foot. Stay on the heel of the front foot. Drive the back knee down. To do that, you have to come off the heel of the back foot, okay? So you breathe in, out, drive that knee down, heel comes up, breathe out as you come up. Breathe in, and out, okay? So that's a lunge from the side. Now I want to do it facing you because there's something very key about a lunge. It's not like a squat or a deadlift where we have a wide base of support. We've got a very narrow base of support, okay? And the fact that we're splitting our stance in a lunge pattern means we're very unstable. And that's the cool thing about a lunge because it helps us work on our trunk stabilizers to keep us from tipping over and moving forward and back. Our core as well, so our abdominal muscles, our spinal rectus, everything around here really gets a good workout here. So what I want you to make sure when you're lunging is that you're not moving from side to side or you're tipping over, okay? And you also have to remember that your knees need to Move in the direction of your toes. They shouldn't go inwards, they shouldn't go outwards. They should track. That's a fancy word, but track your toes, okay? So here's the lunge from the front. Notice I'm not moving from side to side. And notice my knees are going in the same direction as my toes, okay? Breathe in, breathe out. If you can't do the lunge with stability, then only do a partial lunge. A partial lunge would simply be stepping out, bending down a bit, okay? Go as far as there's no pain and you can maintain stability. Remember, heel the front foot on the ground. The knee that's going out goes over the toes. It doesn't go in like this, or it doesn't go out like that. It goes straight over the toe, okay? That's the normal position. Remember to keep your core tight, your back straight and your neck straight as well, okay? There it is, that's a forward lunge with no weights.